or segmentectomy, you remove one or more bronchopulmonary segments that we talked about, the little different tiny compartments that comprise a lobe. And the advantages to a segmentectomy is that it preserves lung tissue and it has a it offers a good lymph node dissection. You can take more lymph nodes. And the disadvantages is that there are uh, slightly more uh, increased risk of prolonged air leak from the lung surface. So after surgery, sometimes the lung gets irritated and leaks lung. And with the segment, you can have more of that. And um, it's a longer operation. It definitely takes longer because, it's, as I mentioned earlier, it's one of the hardest operations that we do because it's harder to tease out the different uh, anatomic lung structures. So this is a picture that I showed earlier. Let's imagine that the tumor is in here. It's in one of the apical segments at the top. And then um, you can see that there's a tumor here. And then this tumor is, uh, there is a particular airway, which is in white, a little blood vessel, which is an arterial branch and a venous branch that are going into that particular lesion. And you can, um, if you want to just take this part out, but do it in a way that also isolates the blood vessels and the airway, you could do a segmentectomy. Uh, this is, for example, a control, uh, example of controlling the uh, pulmonary artery before you take out the lesion. And then, um, uh, and then afterwards, you, you fire off the um, stapler and you divide the lung tissue, but then you also end up dividing the airway, the arterial, and the venous branches.